right now, I think that it's very, we can say, difficult for the ethnic groups because we can, going back to the Cold War situation, at the time they were afraid of communism mm -hmm. and then they used the ethnic like Korean, Karini and Shan as a buffer because at the time the Burmese government is uh, what we call it his policy is you know Burmese way to socialism so they cannot really understand about what does it mean by Burmese way to socialism so that's why uh, these ethnic armed groups they were used as a buffer and then got a lot of I mean, privileges from that time, Thai government. But after the 88, when the Thai, you know, look at the Burma situation, they would like get more business uh, deal with the military regime because the military regime they start using the economy, uh, what should I say, a slogan or, you know, as a open door policy to the, to the international. So everybody would like to grab that op opportunity to do business inside Burma. So Thai is a neighboring country to Burma. And then they start engaged with the regime. Moreover, we can say, I like this government. Mm -hmm. um, they have a lot of problems dealing with Burma, the refugees, the migrant workers, the drug. You know, but the uh, a few people from the government, I think that. They are looking for more opportunity inside. Well.